Hello everyone and welcome to Explore Angola. For several years our team has been discovering this country and they've been amazed. They've had rich cultural experiences, met exceptional people and seen marvelous scenery. We want to share all of that with you today. Let's take a look. From captivating coastlines to lush lands and wonderful waterways, Angola is realizing its tourism potential. The first part of our journey takes us to the vast Namib Desert in the southwest. Then inland we'll explore the nature-rich Kuwandu Kubangu province. Its rivers feed the world-famous Okavango Delta. The Namib Desert runs from Angola through Namibia to South Africa's Kalahari, an impressive feat of nature. Here in the Angolan Pass, you can meet local tribes. And for accommodation, eco-lodges and luxury camping or glamping await. The idea is to bring the European tourists and American tourists and people from all over to come and experience this area. Head further inland and you'll find something unique. Fertile lands, waterways and wildlife. Kuandu Kubangu's rivers flow into the Okavango Delta, one of Earth's last wetland wildernesses. The National Geographic Okavango Wilderness Project team spent years building up a scientific picture of them. For conservationists, Kuandu Kubangu is special. I think I found the spot where I want to stay for the rest of my life. It's just a, a very tranquil place and I see a lot of potential in this area for tourism. Next up, we're heading back to the coast in a thrilling 4x4 adventure. We'll enjoy some cracking scenery with a group of bikers and we'll finish up in Lubitu on a very special train. Angola was made for 4x4s, getting you to special places you may otherwise miss. These enthusiasts ending up where the River Onzu almost meets the ocean. For anyone who likes nature and doing off-road, Angola is an ideal country, excellent in all aspects. Exploring on two wheels is also a great way to discover Angola. Stopping off at awesome places like the Miraduru Overlook. It's a country that has an immense coastline. It's an inviting country. Angola is in fact a power, a hidden secret within regional African tourism. And after all that biking, a night in a luxury lodge. The Mubanga are offering a beautiful rural retreat and a great atmosphere in the evening. You can also let the train take the strain in Angola, admiring the passing beauty from the brand new luxury trail of two oceans. It's the first passenger service running from Dar es Salaam in Tanzania to Lubitu in Angola. From the east to the west of Africa. This is special. The reception in Angola was outstanding. It was quite a trip, 15 days. And just everything was new, everything was different. And I'm just so impressed with how beautiful Angola is. All our adventures like that unbelievable cross-country train are on our Angola webpage on Euronews.com. Thanks for dreaming of travelling and discovering new places with us. See you soon for another Explore Angola.